Assalamu alaikum everyone, Zarin Tasim Priyam here and I'm a 7th grader at Vikram Sunam Swan College as well as a TESOL learner. Today, I'm here with a very cute guest with me. Her name is Progga. Hi Progga. Hi. How are you? I'm fine. And what about you? I'm also doing great. So Progga, you know we were going to give the viewers a big surprise, isn't it? Yeah. So viewers, you think that we are going to give you a surprise, but before that, let me ask Proga a question. Proga, do you know how to do the times table of 99 in an easy way? No. You do not know it? No. I want to test you because I do not believe you. Can you say 99 to sir? No, I can. So, as she doesn't know, 99 to sir equals to what? So, I think you guys know what is our today's surprise. Yes, it is the magical trick of 99's multiplication table. Okay, Proga. So, as you do not know it, I'm gonna also teach you and you also have to give a revision to the viewers after the end of the video. Will you do it for them? Yeah, I will okay. do Okay, so at first, we know that 99 ones are 99. Yeah. That's a common thing. And now, let's move on to 99 twos are. So, I think 99 to user is 198. How? Do you know how? No. So, I'm going to tell you the way. 99 to user 198. How did it become 198? So, as we know that 9 to user equals to 18. And 99 has two 9s. So, we take the first 9. And then, we multiply that 9 with 2. We get 9 to user 18. And... While writing 18, we keep a gap between 1 and 8. And as we have two 9s, we take the second 9 and we put that 9 in the middle. So, thus we can get 1 and 8. I'm repeating, 99 to 0, 198. How did it become 1 and 8? 9 to 0, 18, gap between 1 and 8. And the second 9, we pull it and put in the middle. We get 198. Isn't this easy, Proga? Oh my god, I don't know this easy way can be and this is really magical because mathematics is not that much tough as we think it's really like magic isn't it yeah okay so as we did 99 twoser let's now move on to 99 threeser so what is 99 threeser can you do it with the first method yeah i can just tell me the answer uh, there will be 9 threes are 27 and between 22 and 7 we will take a gap and then the two uh, there, there are two nines and we will take the second nine to the middle of the 27. So what does it become? That becomes 297. Correct. She is 100% correct. 99 threes are 297. How? 9 threes are 27. We keep a gap between 2 and 7. We take the second 9 and we put it in the middle. That means in the gap. So thus we can also do 99 fours are. So 99 fours are can become 396. 99 fives are can become 495. 99 six zero can become 594. 99 seven zero 693. 99 eight zero 792. 99 nine zero 891. And 99 ten zero 990. So let me revise this again and then Proga will teach you how to do this rule. So at first in 99 two zero I did. 9 two zero 18. I kept a gap between 1 and 8. And taking the second 9 of 99, I put it in the middle. That means it becomes 1 and 8. So Proga, can you do 99 five zero now for me? And also the viewers. And first we just multiply 5 and 9. And the answer will be 45. And there are two nines, so between four and five, uh, we just keep a gap and put the nine to middle of the four and five, and the answer will be four nine five. Absolutely correct. So we two learning partners with you guys, we taught you how you can do 99's multiplication in a very easy way up to 99 tensor. So I hope you guys understood what's the rule and isn't it magical really? So please let us know in the comment section 
question that how many of you were able to do this in a very easy way. I know all of you can do it because all of you are the best. So thank you so much everyone for watching this video until the end and please let us know in the comment section how many of you were able to do this quick and easy trick. I know all of you can do it because you all are best. Okay, thank you again so much for watching this video patiently. I and Progga are really pleased that you guys watched it. And until then, keep your eyes on Tissol Bangladesh for our more updates and our more videos. Bye-bye.